poopy butt. Yeah, well, good for you. Uh, are you guys living together? No, that's cool. Um, but if you're thinking about uh, getting married or something, do me a favor. If you haven't lived together, go somewhere uh, for two weeks. Just the two of you. Get in a hotel room where you're subjected to each other's company. 24 hours a day for like two weeks, you'll, and you'll find out how much in love you are. I took this, uh, I took this girl to Hawaii. Uh, uh, just, we were just blazing in love. I couldn't have been more in love. And uh, on the way over to Hawaii, uh, two, two weeks over there, on the way over, we're using our pet names for each other on the flight. You know, Do you want my peanuts, poopy butt? Oh, you're my peanutty wuddy buddy, lumpy. You know? People around us are using their barf bags. <laughs> We've been married 12 years. Can you shut them the fuck up, please? Oh, God. And I'm like, maybe we should tone it down. She went, don't worry, they're just jealous. Oh, yeah, that's what they are, jealous. Poor jaded, cynical fucks. They don't know what love is, do they? We do, poopy butt. <laughs> so we get to Hawaii. I ask at the hotel, I go, hey, I want to go to a nice restaurant tonight. Well, uh, they sent me to the most expensive restaurant on the planet Earth. I've been all over the world. I opened up this menu. I had a grand mal seizure. I started to swallow my own tongue. <laughs> I asked the waitress, I said, is there some reason why these prices are in pesos? Because this can't be fucking American currency you're asking for this. No, I should have said, let's get out of here. If we'd have truly been kindred and really been in love, I think I could have said, let's get out of here. But instead, 90% of my brain is going, you're a cheap bastard. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. So I looked at her, I said, have whatever you want, poopy butt. So the waitress comes over, she looks at the waitress, she goes, I'll have the main lobster. I said, ooh, Maine Lobster in Hawaii. Hey, Poopy, maybe I should draw you a map of the fucking world. <laughs> Maine Lobster in Hawaii. There's a reason that's $380. It took the same flight we did. It was probably sitting up front in the comfortable chairs with a blindfold on, trying to eat a hot fudge sundae without opposable thumbs. Main lobster in Hawaii! <laughs> you ever heard of when in Rome? Burn it down? Go outside and eat a pineapple, you whore! But a man doesn't say that kind of thing. He thinks it. Women don't know what goes on in a man's mind. And a lot of women go, well, you don't know my man. But I tell you what, yes, I do. If you could take the top of a man's head off, uh, like, a, like a mayonnaise jar, and just take the top off and look down inside, you're not going to find thoughts and ideas and memories. You're going to find a bad jazz tree on a bunch of naked broads dancing around. A man thinks terrible things. But I didn't say, plus I need a pineapple, no. Because a man learns at a very early age, it's better to pack that shit away. This is what a man does. He internalizes everything, packs it away, loads some other shit, packs it down, pack, pack, pack. That's what a man does through his whole life, walks around, pack, pack, pack. Women don't get that theory. They want to take everything, throw it on the floor and look at it. And they're like, yeah, no, fucking pack, pack. She said, I'll have the main lobster. You know what I said? Good choice, pack, pack, pack. But now I have to rethink the rest of the vacation because I spent almost the whole food budget on the first meal. I wanted to, I wanted to rent a Jeep, a convertible Jeep, and drive to the volcano with my 14 remaining hairs blowing in the wind. This was my dream. The Jeep was very expensive, so I, you know, got the, you know, Ford Escort. She gets in, she looks at it, she goes, I thought we were getting a Jeep. She goes, this is a piece of shit. I'm like, I changed my mind. Pack, pack, pack. Five minutes out of the hotel parking lot, she, you're lost. Yeah. Women love that. It releases the same endorphins as I love you, but only for women. Yeah. You're lost. Ooh, purple rush of yummy. It's like taking a man's antlers and fucking snapping them right off his head. Yes, at one time men had antlers and they were navigational. You're lost. I said, yeah, I'm on an island. Exactly how long am I going to be lost? Like, well, like as if I'd thrown a fit. Well, one thing I don't fucking pack. Well. I don't know if you've ever been to Hawaii, but it's a recipe for a fight. They got a language there, all of the vowels, and they love them. They got two or three consonants, and they don't trust them. Twice I found nine U's together in a word. If you see nine U's in a word, you think you can pronounce it, Ooh! 
But you can't. You have to go, ooh, 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 the right number of times, like a fucking monkey. They put two airports on the island of Maui. They call one of them something like Hilly Willy Pilly, then they call the other one Willy Willy Polly. Yeah, I go to the wrong one, I'm the idiot. <laughs> I'm, at the air, I'm at the airport, and we just got there just in time to get on the flight, and the guy goes, oh, you're supposed to be at Hilly Willy Pilly, not Willy Willy Polly. Now, here's the problem with the whole packing system, is that sometimes a man runs out of room, and he does no gauge that says, stop packing, you have reached critical mass. And there's just no room to put it anywhere. You know? It's like, well, Father, I'm glad you decided to ride to church with us today. It makes the whole family proud to have you in the car. And then somebody cuts you off. You're like, hey, you Jesus Christ, goddamn butt fuck. What is... <laughs> Sorry, Father, I thought I had some room to pack in there. Jesus, huh? I mean, not Jesus. I'm... So sometimes we have to release a little bit, so we'll have some room to pack later, because God, God knows we'll have to. So this guy's airport, you're supposed to be in Hilly Willy Pilly, not Willy Willy Polly. I go to pack, uh-oh, no room. Why don't you call one of them my, my, pee-pee, ow, ow? What the fuck did you name everything over here? What'd you do, bring a stutterer over and tell him to hurry up? Hey, what would you call that tree? I'm a, I'm a, I'm a okay, that's good. How about that mountain? Oh, bye, 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 bye. How about that bird? Oh, oh, yeah, that'll be the fucking oh, oh, bird, won't it? She grabs hold of my arm. She goes, you are making a scene. I went, no, this is a scene. Maine Lobster!